I mean, throughout that whole time, I was training, I was going out on auditions, I was trying to, to become an actor. Um, and then I had a big break on a little show called The Game. The Game, on the CW actually, before it was on, B, on BET. Um, and Mara Akil changed my life. I walked into that audition to audition for a one-time uh, guest star and uh, ended up playing Dion for three years and then also coming back on season on the last season of the show. So that was really when everything right. changed. When, when you I... got that role on the game, what did you know going into it? And in retrospect throughout the years, how do you feel not only about the role, but what fans tell you about that role? That's a fascinating one with Dion especially because I loved Dion. I thought she was a professional. She was like this badass bitch who was like, yeah. <laughs> but not in a bad way, you know? Uh -huh. like, I'm gonna hand J Lo. That's what I thought. She was J Lo. She's gonna handle her sh her ish. Um, yeah. She, you know, <laughs> no one's gonna tell her what's what because she already knows. You know, mm -hmm. she actually already knows. She's not just someone who thinks she knows. She's on top of it. So that's who I thought Dion was, and I was so excited to play that. You know, just in yeah. her hand. And I walked into the room with Mara and Salim. Mara is the creator and writer. Uh -huh. Salim was her uh, is her husband and was the director, so he was uh -huh. sitting in, um, and then like fifteen other people. It was a really big casting wow. um, as far as who was in the room executives. So uh -huh. I was very nervous, and I walked in and I just looked at Mara because she's the one I was talking to and reading with, and I was like, I'm going to business the heck out of this woman. <laughs> That's it, right? And then I uh -huh. and then because they were casting so fast, they actually kept us all together. There were about twenty people testing for the part. And um, they kept us all there, and you're, you know, just looking at this room full of gorgeous, could not be more stunning women who are, like, have their crap together. Uh -huh. and once I got the, the job, Mara told me it was fascinating that it wasn't even a question, that I had the job hands down when I walked in, because wow. every other girl walked in and flirted, and oh, <laughs> and oh, you know, <laughs> and I was like, I don't have uh -huh. time for that, <laughs> I'm here for business. Everybody go to YouTube after this interview and watch that opening scene because uh -huh. that is like textbook 101, acting 101. She took what was on the script and she amplified it. And that's why Mara chose her. So if you're an actor in here, if you're a creative like Jason is, right? You have to take what's on the script, right? Take direction from the director but also live in that character. And as other actors would, would say, not judge that character, but how would you step into the psychology of that actor? Absolutely. And I just read a comment, would I be interested in more scripted work? Absolutely. I'm on a scripted show right now that I'm actually nominated for an Emmy. A second yes, time. yes. Please, please um, speak about that as well. Well, I, but mostly just to say I love scripted TV. I, uh -huh. I love creating. I just like telling stories. If it's a good character, I'm in. You know, good or good character, meaty role, whether it's good or bad. Uh -huh. To me, that's so interesting to bring that to life and tell that story. Um, I, I just love it. And Dion was never bad to me. She wasn't even like, I never even got, <laughs> so many people thought she was a capital bitch, like capital yeah. bitch, you know? And I was like, really? She just kind of knows what she wants and she doesn't take flack. Uh -huh. And she like... You know, yes, she definitely was like to the nines all the time, even like on a treadmill, she had lashes on, which is a lot. But other than that, <laughs> she was just, you we, know, we need, like we, she knew we, what she wanted. We need an official or maybe an unofficial spinoff because you yes. are, <laughs> you I are agree. all Dion would have been that. so fascinating to follow. I don't know why they weren't as in love with Dion as I was. I mean, there were just a lot of people. <laughs>